And good morning, class. So we're going to be working on Flickr, and I'm going to show you what we're going to do, and then we're going to get a chance to do it. So when you see on the screen, the following screen that asks you to hold your card so that A is pointing up and the image is facing the camera, you are going to get your Flickr card, and it should look something like this. You would have it on paper, or I have it on my device. And what I'm going to do is that I am going to look, and there are some tiny, tiny letters, as you can see on yours, A, B, this is C, B, A, and D. And so I need to flip it so that the A is pointing at the top. Now yours might look different because every image is going to be different from your classmates. So only you are going to be able to see what part is A. And that is important because we want you to be able to have your own answer and so here, you're going to hold your card so that the A is up here at the top. And if you're at home, you're going to hold it up against the screen. And if you are in the classroom, let's pretend that I'm in the classroom. I am going to walk around with my device. And I am going to point my device, and this is what I'm going to be seeing. It's going to look at this, and it's going to come up and show you. And you saw what happened? It finally said, it identified that I have my card one and it has recorded it. So you're going to try that. And let's see, if you, when you hold it up, I will scan it using my phone. And once it's done, you get to see how many people have answered that question as you're working on it. Now, when we're finished, I'm going to show you the correct one and you get to see what you got. And we get to see how many people got the right answer or the wrong answer. And we can talk about what were the questions that you had about it, why you thought it was something else. And in this case, we're just testing out how to hold our cards. And so this makes you pay attention. Oh, did I have A on top? No, what happened? So we're going to test it out with the next one. Now let's try it. B. Now get your card and I'm going to hold my card so that B is pointing up. Okay. And this is a different student's card. So you will see how it looks like at the end. And I'm going to record my image. There it goes, card two. And then on my phone, I can stop recording it. I can show you, you can now see how many responses we got and I can show you the correct answer. Now what happens, let's look at the next one and see what happens when someone holds up the wrong answer. So let's pretend that I just forgot and I am holding it up and I didn't pay a lot of attention. Sometimes it does stick a little bit. There you go. So my card one set not on top. To show correct. And unfortunately we didn't get a lot of answers. That answer we did not get correct. Okay. So now uh, we're going to go ahead and Try the next, and you saw that I have a different question towards the end that will not have a right or wrong answer. So we're going to go back, and now we're going to get a chance to practice doing A, B, C, and D. And then we're going to practice using a survey in which there will not be no right answer or wrong answer. It's just an opinion. Then we will see how our, 
how our class does. All right, let's give it a try. <laughs>